Um, I would say I feel good. I think it's clear that I have my like special plan for myself, trying to stay healthy and be healthy. Um, but I feel good going into the tournament, and um, I'm just thankful for the club that they're able to really take care of me. <laughs> I think we're uh. We're in a good place. I think we're playing competitive and um, I think we're motivated for the Copa. I think last year is like motivation enough. Um, so uh, I think we're just in a good way. I think like every year the Copa is going to be just tough and um, everyone is going to show up. It's like everyone is at zero, you know, like it doesn't matter if you're first in the league. It doesn't matter how your last game was, how, how your last five were, like it doesn't matter you get there and everyone shows up. And I think that's what's special about the Copa. So we just have to show up and bring our A game. And I hope we, we can do that. And I also hope we can grow with every game. Um, so I'm excited to play. Okay. I think they're a tough team. They're playing good basketball. Um, when we played against them in Idika, it's always tough to play there. So, uh, But then that to say, like, I think every team in the Spanish league is a good team. Like everyone... Um, brings like brings something to the table that is hard to play against. So we just have to show up on Thursday, and we have to do our job, like take the win and go step by step. So I think it's gonna be a competitive game for sure. I think playing our game, focusing on us, focusing on the things that we wanna like get better at, but also like that we're doing good. I think Edeka has a good team. Obviously, we have to look at what they're doing, but I think it's also a game where we really have to like show our strength and um, just play our game, you know, like go in as a team, have fun and um, play defense. I think our, to every game, our advantage and our strength is our defense. And when we defend, we can run. So I think our defense and then our transition game are the keys to that game for sure um i think so i'm yeah maybe uh i think last year was also pretty i mean obviously girona had some injury problems last year which made it maybe a little less competitive for them but um i think still last year was super balanced and the years before i always felt like it was like quite good competition um, but that speaks for the Spanish league. So I think this year it's going to be the same. And I think this year the league made us another step forward of like being more competitive. So obviously this year it's going to be more balanced. Um, but generally I would say like every year the Copa has been very challenging for us and something that is like, it's a hard tournament. Yeah. yeah. I think so. I think, I mean, my first year here in Spain, I was like, what is this about? Like, I was like, why is everyone so stressed and excited? And there's like this, this energy to it, you know? And um, with the years I've played here, I obviously also have become like more invested into like the league, the people, the club. Like, obviously I want the best for my team, my club. Like, um, so, and like every year we kind of fall short in the Copa. So I think it's a special tournament for everyone and everyone really values it and everyone is proud of it. So, um, it is really special. Okay. Yeah. I mean, it, it would mean a lot. Like I said, right, just right now, I think like with every year, the cup um, kind of means more to me because like you have some history, you have some like emotional connection. Like last year was tough. The year before was tough. Like it was just always hard when you don't win these games, you really want to win. So, um, I think with every year, the motivation grows to like really wanting that title. And it would be nice to say, like, I won every title in the Spanish League. And um, that would be something I would be really, really proud of. So um, I think, like, it's a it's a special trophy for sure, yeah. Huh. Um, I think both. I think it's a balance. But in the end, like, if you make it to the final, you're going to face a team that has played the exact amount of games. So everyone is tired, and everyone is tired at this point of the season. I think it's undeniable. Like, if you play that many games, your Euro League or some of Euro Cup, you play a lot of games. So this is a moment where everyone maybe physically might be a little more tired. So I think emotionally, mentally, it's, like, more important for this tournament just to, like, stay ready to, like, move on from maybe not-so-good games from a stay quicker, like, have a quick turnaround and just focus on the next step you know so i think the mental part in tournaments like this where you have a lot of games like in 
a short amount of time. Yeah. Mentally, I think it's it's like important to be sharp. Yeah. Um, I'm really excited. I'm really. Uh, it means a lot to me because I've never thought I would be able to, and um, the German national team and I, we had our journey, I would say, and it has not always been um great and now we've been we are in a place where i feel like proud that i stuck with it i fought um for my teammates i fought to compete and um we finally at a point where we can and where we have the support and so i'm super proud that i was part of the journey and that we were successful i mean that speaks a lot to like who we are as players so i'm really 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 proud of it i'm excited to just be a part of like the olympic community yeah, yeah. As an athlete, I think that's an honor. Congrats. Thank you.